Okay, guys, uh, this is Adam, right? We have a bit of a, a competition going on, okay? He's beat me in Mario Kart, you know, and then I bet him in the next round, you know, overall, in the, in the next cup. So we have one left to go. <laughs> do, do you think you can beat me in the last final round? Mmm, I might. Mice. You might. I'm mice. If I play well. <laughs> if you play well, do you think you could beat me in Fortnite? Um, Probably not. No. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we'll see what happens, won't we? Okay. You weak shit. Hey guys, Barry here, and welcome back to your gaming station, Tenemat Gaming. And today I am at the APIT Gaming Conference up here in Griffith College, and there's a ton of stuff here. Retro, of course, you can buy loads of games here, secondhand games. And uh, you're up ahead, you can see some developers, you know. And uh, oh, up ahead, I can see Adam. He's just there, uh, smiling away. He's looking. But uh, all right, guys, let's see the rest of the show. Hey guys, here we have Brian, and he's making a game called Laser Girl. Is that yep. something like that? Yep, yep. Laser Girl. Yeah. yeah, it's like the opposite of Bomberman, you know, basically. Yeah. yeah. So I guess basically, tell me about yourself. You know, like how long have you been making this game as well? Well, I've been making this game since like roughly the start of the year, um, and um, I, I just kind of I, I made a prototype and then I, I brought it to show and then people joined me and we got an artist, we got a music guy, and yeah. I mean, we kind of and we have a marketing guy and yeah, we're. Um, we're getting ready to release uh, this version of it. Hey guys, here we have Peter from Fierce Fun. How are you, sir? Hey, Barry. How are you doing? So tell me about your game. You know, like uh, I have seen, I haven't played it yet, but I guess as we're maybe watching this, you'll see me play the game. So tell us what the game is about. So Mindframe Arena, as you can see here. So it's a board battler game uh, for mobiles. Might be released again on PC. And it's essentially a game where you have five characters uh, that you play and you're playing against another five characters. And you upgrade your, we call it a faction, and basically each character has a spell. And so the idea is to find a perfect faction to get you deep into the world. So it's a mixture of board game, uh, there's also some maybe some RPG elements in it, uh, uh, and a strategy game as well. So it's a bunch of things, We kind of it's hard to classify, which is kind of good, you know? So a mixture of things, basically, yeah. Hey guys, here we have Thiago. Thiago, <laughs> yeah. I guess from EM Games, how's it going? How's it going? Good, yeah, yourself? I'm all right, thanks. So uh, yeah, tell us, uh, you know, who are you? Tell us about your game as well, because I actually have seen your game before. Yeah, like. you said that, yeah. So my name is Thiago, I'm part of Electronic Motion Games. And uh, we're coming up with this new game now uh, called Outero. Different, depends on the way you pronounce. Some people pronounce Outero, Outero, but anyway, Outero. <laughs> and it's a puzzle platform game. And uh, so this game, we have this uh, main mechanics that the game, uh, the main player, the main character needs to sacrifice himself. And uh, so basically needs to die in order to pass through the obstacles. Oh, really? yeah. <laughs> so like, it's uh, the other way around, right? Yeah, because you don't see a game, you know, oh, hey, you must die to get yeah. past this. There you go, yeah, that's the whole idea of the game. And uh, you need to face uh, redemption, face death, and that's all connect to your past as well. So basically, it relies on puzzles. And most of the puzzles, you need to rely on death and, and sacrifice in order to pass through, you know? 